It's the love that I'm attached to, frankly. The love I got when I was um, a child. And I would get a piece of paper and my mom would see me draw the Flintstones. It reminds me of my mom saying, wow, son, you're gonna become a famous cartoonist one day. Look at you. Look at how you can just draw this thing. I'm in love with this process. I'm in love with the tactile feeling of being a cartoonist. Syracuse was difficult and challenging because I was in a personal crisis. I'm from a single mom, Dot Armstrong, very determined woman, but she was diagnosed with cancer when I was a senior in high school and it took her life. I was on a very urgent mission, I call it that, to succeed at Syracuse, to succeed at life. But Syracuse has a bigger mission than just making a kid feel at home. They're in the business of preparing you to excel, to be at the top of the industry that you enter into. That's the way I took it. I first met Rob when he was art director of the Daily Orange. When you would open up the Daily Orange, you would see Hector, and it was on a full page of other student-drawn comics. But Hector was, it, it was out of place because it was, it was so good. Everybody else, you know, we were all like junior varsity, <laughs> you know? But Rob's strip was like, it was professional. This is Hector. Hector was autobiographical work. I was trying to document my feelings about being a, a student at Syracuse. And because I was so driven to become a cartoonist someday, I thought of my, my time at the Daily Orange as this gift, this tremendous gift. Rob has a tremendous why. When he does what he does, it's actually for not just the world, but it's also for the people that, that brought him into this world who are no longer here. Rob has a talent for taking everything that he notices that goes on in the world and having it come out in these characters, but he does it in a, in a way that easily recognizable for everybody that looks at the cartoon. Jumpstart has tapped into something going on in this world with the police and the black men things I had touched on a long time ago, the 1980s, are now front and center. Jumpstart's been running every day since 1989. It would not be a reality without Syracuse. My entire career would not be a reality without Syracuse University. Right now, I'm involved with a Peanuts worldwide collaboration called the Armstrong Project. It's designed to bring the next creative voices forward from places that might not have the opportunity. My personal success comes meaningless without showing other people the way in, because that's where we're gonna see biggest change in the industry. I'm Rob Armstrong, I'm a syndicated cartoonist. I do Jumpstart, and I am forever 